like how strong your influence is at that point because it hasn't happened. Like you say some right. things that I get scared. Like areas of strength for what mean for is by then since it hasn't occurred like you express a few things that I get frightened of. Let that be an example to every one of the harassers may it be in satire. May it be in any place no one can tell who you soaking to is Hollywood's cherished Oprah. Winfrey furtively employing her ability to quietness pundits in an industry where the sparkle of distinction frequently veils the battles of the individuals who set out to stand up another debate has arisen. Creating long shaded areas over the captivating veneers of Hollywood's tip top at the core of this tempest is, as a matter of fact, Oprah Winfrey the sovereign of daytime television turned news tycoon who currently stands blamed for capitalizing on her titanic leverage to sideline entertainer Tara. G.P. Henson this evening to Raji P. Henson's severely fair and close-to-home clarification of Hollywood's compensation dissimilarity is turning into a web sensation these charges come sweltering closely for. Following Henson's close-to-home overflow about pay differences during a meeting with Gade Ruler, the entertainer known for her unbelievable ability and unashamed credibility uncovered that she'd been lowballed her whole profession expressing I'm burnt out on really buckling down being charitable. At what I do getting compensated a small part of the expense the planning of Henson's meeting sent shockwaves to the business with online entertainment. Humming with doubts, some recommended that Oprah Matt may be under A. Henson and her dark co-stars including Fantasa Barino and Hal Bailey on the film they teamed up on Purple. However, no substantial proof upheld these cases. The murmurs of Hollywood mysteries develop stronger you have menaces in this business and the domineering jerks are so used to. Being menaces, they don't have the foggiest idea when someone nibble back right and not bark back, they chomp back right yet, here's where it gets juicier than a daytime drama rapper transformed money man. Augur 50 Penny raged into the discussion flinging claims at, in all honesty, Steve Harvey himself as per 50 Penny Oprah's fury towards Henson for supposedly discoloring the film's standing has prompted a mischievous mission to delete Henson from Hollywood's reserving list. That right, Steve Harvey, the charming television host and jokester, is presently up to speed in the whirlwind blamed for being a willing associate in Oprah's supposed plan to debase land GP Henson, 50 Penny Nev. Er W to avoid discussion has volunteered to be Tier G's knight in Sparkling Shield. He's not only a rapper and entertainer, he's currently the business's crusader against supposed treacheries in a striking move he freely safeguarded Henson against Oprah's supposed activities outlining them as a feature of a bigger example of conduct, it's P sweltering and he's chief. He's essentially head with a similar force he brings to his verses 5050 penny. Announced they failed, I'm prepared to work. How about we rep? Sivet approval group G unit film and television. He's declaring war, offering Henson an opportunity to work with him in his unit film and television division. Currently, isn't this a curve deserving of a Hollywood blockbuster 50 penny? who once had his own issue with Henson during the Realm V. Influence contention has exchanged sides and is broadening a hand of kinship. It's practically lovely, isn't it yet? What's the genuine rationale behind 50 Penny's unexpected shift in perspective? Is he truly worried for Henson's vocation? Or does he have a score to settle with the supreme sovereign of daytime television before we hop straight into the 50 Penny Harvey Oprah show? How about we stop briefly to consider the more extensive main thing in need of attention foundational pay disparity in Hollywood? This isn't an instance of one entertainer feeling duped and unavoidable issue influences dark entertainers all through the business no matter what their status or achievements take Tara G.P. Henson for. Instance, she's a force to be reckoned with of ability, but she admitted during her Sirius XM interview that she hadn't seen a raise in that frame of mind since Please Marry Now on the off chance that you've seen Please Marry. You realize she totally claimed that job it ought to have been her. Brilliant to get to the major associations yet. Rather, she got a proposal for Purple that was so low it could make your jaw drop, and it's not simply Henson and unfortunate patterns been occurring for a really lot. Ain time, as she put it, getting compensated a small portion of the expense I'm fed up with hearing my sister say exactly the same thing again and again. Even Viola Davis, a stalwart entertainer, with an Oscar Annie and two Tonys added to her repertoire, stood in opposition to her tireless underpayment.
and I'm number one on the call sheet and afterward, I need to go in and I need to hustle for my value. That is what I feel as I'm doing. This isn't a modest bunch of disappointed entertainers, a stunningly odd. Via's problems asking for change, so as we unwind the dramatization encompassing Oprah, Steve Harvey, and Terrera G.P. Henson, we should recollect that it's a side effect of a lot bigger disease tormenting the business currently. How about we limited our concentration and analyze the encounters of people of color in Hollywood? These charges and discussions aren't segregated occurrences yet, part of a more extensive example of conduct that lessens the commitments and worth of individuals of color in media. Uh, Outlets and on the off chance that I can't battle for them coming up behind me, then the thing the, um, I doing I'm sorry definitely I know don't apologize. Don't apologize, it's not just about pay disparity. It's additionally about the abuse and lack of regard these skilled ladies face as Tony. Braxton uncovered even somebody as unbelievable as herself confronted Oprah's anger during a meeting Braxton known for her famous R&B profession and appearances on the unscripted T V drama Braxton Family Value. S related her own difficulty with the sovereign of television shows as per Braxton Oprah's meeting got ugly when the moderator interrogated her regarding her monetary battles Braxton, who had declared financial insolvency anticipated some compassion and backing yet rather was met with a loss as Oprah. Even scrutinized her acquisition of creator tableware expressing I heard you have Gucci silverware. I am Oprah Winfrey and I don't have Gucci silverware. A stunning disclosure makes you wonder exactly how. Doubly persuasive figures in Hollywood can use their influence rocks and imparted that this experience to Oprah significantly affected her profession-making individuals peer down on her vocation-making individuals peer down on her. It's a demonstration of the influence that specific industry insiders hold and how they can shape the story around a VIP's life and profession and quickly she caused me to feel this large currently. How about we make a plunge into the most recent stunner in this tangled snare of Hollywood dramatization? This isn't 50 Penny's first rodeo with regards to clashing with Oprah in a stunning disclosure from his new book Hustle, Harder Hustle. More intelligent, the rapper turned versatile openly concedes to purposely becoming foes with Oprah Winfrey after a fairly rough beginning. Back when 50 Penny was on the ascent to popularity, he fantasized showing up on Oprah's notable television show to demonstrate his significance to his grandma anyway. Things took a sharp turn when Oprah hoped. Lee hammered him marking his verses as sexist and blaming him for celebrating firearm savagery she was totally against all that was in my music, 50 cent reviews. So she ain't never going to have me on that show, I'm never gonna arrive at that stage which is affirmation of you being a tremendous achievement so I just said, okay, in the event that we can't be companions then. At that point, basically we should be foes as a curious bit of destiny. 50 Penny even named his canine after the veteran anchor P. Urson and didn't keep away from taking hits at her proposing that her fan base comprised of only old white ladies discuss a strong move right. You have two, three pets too, a canine and a feline with fascinating names most definitely no doubt no doubt the goodness that is opera. Okay? Yet, here's where things get significantly seriously interesting lately. 50 Penny has demonstrated the fact that he is a protector of entertainers confronting misfortune in the business right when he figured and the dramatization couldn't get any thicker he's presently standing up in the port of another Hollywood ability who's been sidelined. And Monique, you don't stress over drop culture, huh? How could you drop things that extraordinary for the way of life, right? Like, I mean, like I resemble drop, like... Monique, for what reason is she drop mom? You might recall Monique for her staggering presentation in Valuable and her Oscar win back in 2009 anyway. She's been secured in a harsh quarrel for certain big she- Ots in media outlets remembering Oprah and Steve Harvey for a new meeting, 50 Penny made plainly. He had